Good morning, good morning, good morning. Happy Monday, it is Makeover Monday. I thought I would try and do as many um, <clears throat> video, makeup, whatever, um, as possible every Monday for at least the month of um, April. So yeah, um, I have so much going on guys. I thought, you know, this is a better way for me to get more in tune with you guys. Yes, my face is breaking out. I just had a facial treatment done on my nose, so it's peeling. Um, it'll heal quickly. It just looks worse before it gets better. Um, but anyway, so, yeah, so much going on. Um, on Friday, I quit my job um, in marketing. I now am strictly working from home, no office job at all. Um, I will be doing... What is it? Um, oh, be a client concierge for Mark Spain Real Estate. So that's fun. It's a new journey. Really excited about it. That's part of the things that, you know, we've been praying for. Um, so yeah, because I have to be able to have health insurance and all that stuff. And, you know, when I can tell you guys the full story, I totally will. Just can't right now. Um, but anyway, so I will be able to do a lot more because I'll be home all the time now. So yeah, we're having a lazy Monday today. Just kind of resting this week before I start my new job. And so I thought I'll do some makeup for you guys. Just something quick, nothing crazy. <clears throat> um, I wanted to highlight, we do have a huge um, Mother's Day product launch coming up on the 15th, I believe, yeah. We will be having a brand new palette. Um, I might be wrong on that. I think I'm getting my stuff confused. But we do have a tint balm thing coming out. I'm gonna do a video to like tell you more about that stuff later, um, probably later this week. <clears throat> um, what else? Oh, we do have cotton. Um, like makeup removing pads coming out. They're reusable, so you can just wash them. Guys, I love those so much. I've had some from another company um, that didn't work as well, but these are these are amazing. It's literally just like a little cotton cotton pad round, and you just get it wet with warm water, wash it off, or wash your makeup off, and you're done. So easy, best stuff ever. It's a lot like our microfiber cloths. Um, what else? Um, also, we will be offering um, gift wrapping. If you buy something as a gift, you can get it gift wrapped with really awesome Saint labeling. And if you know Saint, you know all of their stuff is just like gorgeous. Like their packaging is awesome. Um, so yeah, that's a lot of the Mother's Day stuff. Um, we are going to be having, I think this is also in April. I can't remember the date. I'm sorry, guys. There's so many dates running through my head. But also in April, we will be having our um, new sign-up promotion. So that's going to be where you get um, the Pro Blanc palette. So it's a really big palette. It's gorgeous. It's so pretty. Like, I'm jealous because I want it. <laughs> um, you get that for free. Instead of, usually you just start off with like this one and two of these and then a big one. So this is usually what you start off with, or two of two of these, sorry. Um, and then your double decker and then the giant one that has like three levels. That's what you get with your um, basic kit. But with the sign up promotion, you get the pro palette. It's just a lot bigger. I'll show graphics of that too. Um, and then also with that, you get um, the a free Blanc ticket. So what is Blanc? It is our virtual annual meetup. Um, so signing on as a new artist, I know it can be overwhelming. You're like, holy crap, how do I even do this? Where do I start? Um, this free Blanc ticket gets you in to it's gonna be virtual training, meetups, hangouts, like all, I mean, just all kinds of stuff. Um, our founder, Kara, will be doing tips and tricks and, you know, talking to us about how to better market your business. 
um, makeup tips and tricks, um, ways to help clients. I mean, just so much. It's amazing. It's awesome. And you get to meet new artists and all from the comfort of your home. Um, so yeah, you get a free ticket to that. Usually tickets are like 40 to $90 in that range and you get it for free. So that's awesome. Um, and along with that, you get your whole pro kit. So, or artist kit. There's the basic and the pro, whichever one you want. Um, and you get to hang out with me all the time. So there you go. Um, so yeah, if any of you are really interested in that, please let me know. Just comment below, send me a message, whatever. I'm here for you guys. And yeah, it's just really exciting. Just lots of fun stuff happening right now. I can't even believe it. Like, I think I need to go live this week just to talk about all of it with you guys because there's just so much amazing things happening that I can't put it into one video. So yeah, so I'm gonna quit talking and I'm just gonna put some makeup on. Just a little bit, like I said, we're not going anywhere today, but my skin is sad. I had so much sugar over the weekend, so much like beer and <laughs> celebrating my husband turning 30, so my skin is just like, um, stop. So there we go. All right, yeah, let's do some makeup. So I already have a base of my like I washed my face this morning. Um, I don't have a primer on, but I do have my moisturizer on, which if you don't like to use a primer, you can use moisturizer too, it's just fine. So I'm gonna go in with my white peach. I have butter fingers today, sorry guys. My white peach, that's my main highlight. And over my like spots, I'm just dotting it in. Um, I need to, Maybe this weekend I'll get um, an order placed. If you have a lot of redness, a really good tip is As Aspen Contour. Just dot that on your redness. I don't have Aspen, unfortunately. I've seen it used and I've used it from other people's palettes, but I have not yet gotten it for myself. Um, but you just dot it and it acts as a color corrector. So. It's really awesome. It kind of is like a magical color. <laughs> Same with Frenchie. Um, I will show you how I use my Frenchie. I'll probably use that today. Um, Frenchie is good if you have blue, purple spots, like bags under your eyes, things like that, which I feel like I have so many bags under my eyes. So yeah, I'm just dotting my makeup on. I told you my skin's really breaking out. I wasn't gonna do a makeup video cause I'm like self-conscious that my face is breaking out so bad. But then I was like, people need to see that this makeup's amazing and it'll cover everything. So here I am. Okay, so that's it for my main highlight. I'm gonna go in now with my brightening highlight. Mine is linen. I have another one. I need to melt this one down. I use it a lot. And I'm gonna start here, the corner of my nose and right on top of my chin. And you can already see how it makes those smile lines like totally disappear. I'm gonna dot it on my nose cause I'm gonna go in later, my contour. And I have a cool contour trick I wanted to show you guys. And just add that to dotting to cover up. There you go. Um, so now, before I do my under eye, I wanna show you guys the magic of Frenchie. So I like to use my multitasker brush. It has a round flat end up top. You can see I use it a lot. Um, I use that a lot for my lip, you know, our lip and cheek colors. I use it for the lip part. And then this other end is kind of pointed, a little thicker. Um, I use that for my eyeliner. So I'm just going to use the flat end. And here's Frenchie. Get just a little bit on my brush. I'm going to dab it right where I have some blue purplish color. And this is gonna add as a color corrector because 
this like coral orangey red color cancels out blue and purple. So, and it's a lip and cheek and it's really pretty, it's a lip and cheek. So now I have my Frenchie on, I can go in and do my brightener. And you do just the corner right over where you put your Frenchie. And then blend that all in. And you wanna be careful not to put your Frenchie anywhere that isn't purple or blue because then it's gonna show up as red. Look at the difference. How insane is that? It's so crazy. I love Frenchie so much. If you don't have Frenchie, you gotta get it. Especially on a Monday. Okie dokie. I'm just blending it all. I'm not dipping into my palette again. You don't need to. A little goes a long way. Ta-da! Okay. So now for my little contour trick. So I have my eyeshadow brush. You can use your eyeshadow brush, your smudge brush, whatever you want to use. Um, but this end of the eyeshadow brush, the smaller end, is a smudge. So you don't really need the smudge brush. If you don't want it, you can use the eyeshadow. Because then you also get the blending part. Yeah. Um, so take your smudge end a little bit into your contour. Here's mine. It's Astoria. And then you're going to use that to contour your nose. If you're like me and you tend to over blend your contour, like your nose contour, I'm the worst at that, oh my gosh, guys. Then this is what you wanna, wanna try to use. Go right in here, a little bit on the top, give myself a little button nose look. Ta -da. And my nose is contoured. It's so much easier. You can also try that trick I've told people is like use your finger. Hold on, I'll show you in a minute. you can clean it up whatever but with this you're not over blending because that's literally like my biggest issue so you can use like I can't use my pinkies because I've had a botched surgery on this one but use your fingers dip them into contour rub it together and then go straight down and that'll give you the same effect so really easy and I like to add a little bit of brightener on the side just to give me that snatched nose look You're basically just kind of cleaning up those edges right there. There you go. So now I can go in with my normal contour. So this is the detail brush. So I like to use this in for my brightener and my like concealer, all that kind of stuff. And then this in the flat, like rounded, whatever for my contour. Cause it's, I mean, it's just perfect. It's that simple and now I'm done with my contour. So I'm just gonna use this to blend it out. You can also use your perfector sponge. I just don't have mine damp right now. That's it. So now I can go in with my lip and cheek. I have been really into this um, desert sunset lately. So the April shade of the month is Lolly. I don't have it. I hear it's a lot like La Saniga. Um, I feel like it's a lot like La Saniga and um, what's this one? Not that one. 
and hold on guys user error right now okay like okay so this is venice and this is la saniga i feel like it's a good mix between these two so i'm gonna use Try not to use Desert Sunset because I've been using it so much lately. All right, we're gonna try sandstone and something else. Let's see. I'm gonna put some sandstone on my cheeks. This is our blush and bronzer brush. I really, really like this for, um, well, blush and bronzer. It just gives you that perfect amount. You don't have to use this. You can use your finger, which is what I use like if I'm in the car or on the go, but it just gives you that perfect like blushed look. So, all done. And then this end is what I use for my bronzer because it's just perfect. Doesn't put on too much or whatever. All right, so I think I'm gonna go in with Love Spell. Love spell, and then let's go in with some sandstone and see what that looks like. It's so much fun to mix and play with the colors because they're so pretty and they're so easy to mix. And then I want to show you guys a little trick. You're gonna do this before your you put your open cheek on or after whatever, but. Now I have bigger lips. You just go in with whatever is left over on your contour brush, push your lips in and rub it on and you're done. And then you have like plumper lips, I guess. So oh, I just rubbed all that off guys. What's wrong with me? Okay. So I'm going to go in with my eyes and show you guys a little bit of what I do with that. I have literally nothing planned out. This is just winging it guys. And also, this will stay all day. I just rubbed it off because I'm crazy. And I'll use our setting spray and powder to show you guys that. Okay, time for eyes. I'm gonna show you guys. So I use the line brush to do my eyebrows. Just this little end right here, and then you have your spoolie. I dip it into my coal. And you kind of just feather that in there. That is just about it. Super easy, super quick. No hassle, easy brows. And then I can go in with our brow wax and if I wanted them to be bushier, if I wanted them to look, what is that word? Like what people are doing right now, then I could go in with our brow wax and do that, but that's not the look I'm going for today. So I wanna show you guys a really fun thing that I've done forever, but right now it's like a trend between artists as you take your illuminator or your eyeshadow just a little bit. And look at how pretty that is. To get just a little shimmer on your new lip color and it just makes it a whole nother, whole nother look and I love it. And then as always, you can put your illuminator and your high points. 
I like to use our illuminators as eyeshadows too sometimes. Just makes it so much better. All right, so I'm gonna go in with basic. Kinda all over the lid. And this is our eyeshadow brush. I'm using the blend side because I don't want it to be too pigmented. Just enough. I'm gonna use a smudge in and go in with pomegranate. Just around the crease and in that corner. And I like to blend it up. You never wanna blend your eyeshadow down and you never wanna go past your um, brow because that's gonna pull your whole face down. And then again, in the crease, in the corner, blend it up. Ta-da! And you can use whatever's left over of your pomegranate. Just underneath to give it like a little bit more dimension, make your eyes pop a little bit more. And that's about all I wanna do because like I said, we're having a lazy day today. I'm gonna go in with my multitasker brush again into our Black Friday eyeliner. It gives it that really nice, subtle look. It's not gonna be like a liquid liner where it's very bold. You can also use your setting spray on this brush and go in with an eyeshadow. I've done that so many times. Ta-da! So, it's basically my look. I'm just gonna go in with some mascara and call it a day. It's that easy, guys. If I wasn't doing this on camera to show you guys, it would take me about five minutes. I'm trying to use my phone as my mirror for my mascara and that's probably dangerous. All right, and that is it. This is my lazy day hanging out at home look. Um, you can see everything is covered. It's easy, it's quick. If I had a Zoom meeting, this would probably be my go-to face. But yeah, um, we have lots of promotions going on, guys. If you're interested in joining the artist program and taking advantage of those promotions, please let me know. I'd love to chat. Um, I am going to have a video coming out more in detail about my why, about why I joined Saint and what it did for me. Um, emotionally, it's just taking a minute for me to actually create that video because Saint, Saint did so much for me, guys. It saved me in so many ways. Um, yeah, so I will eventually have a video worked up for that. It's just, it's emotional for me. Um, yeah, Saint has been amazing for me, literally the best thing ever, but yeah. So anyway, <laughs> um, if you guys have any questions, if you haven't been color matched and you want to be color matched, um, to get your palette, let me know. And yeah, I hope you guys have an amazing week. Have a great Monday and I hope this video helped. Love you guys. Bye.